Hello friends, today we are going to understand monopoly market structure and its types in detail with different examples. Let us start with the meaning of monopoly. If you break up the word monopoly, you get mono which means single or solo and poly which means seller. A market structure characterized by a single seller selling a unique product in the market. In a monopoly market, the seller faces no competition as he is the sole seller of goods with no close substitute. For example, De Beers is known to have a monopoly in the diamond industry. I have included 7 types of monopoly in my video. 1. Simple Monopoly This is one of the monopoly market structure. Here, a simple monopoly firm charges a uniform price for its products when selling to all its buyers. A simple monopoly operates in a single market with a single price, unlike a discriminating monopoly that operates in more than one market. Examples, water supply, railway services, etc. 2. Discriminating monopoly Price differentiation is a special power that a monopoly enjoys. It bases its objective on profit maximization. Monopoly can either choose to price differentiation and quantity differentiation. Therefore, a discriminatory monopoly, as the name suggests, discriminate its buyers in different markets with different prices. For example, when a new flight is scheduled, airlines tend to lower the price of tickets to raise demand. After enough tickets are sold, ticket prices increase and the airline tries to fill the remainder of the flight at the higher price. 3. Pure Monopoly this particular type of monopoly differs from all the other monopoly types because the substitutes available for the product in pure monopoly is zero. This means that pure monopolies do not even have a remote substitute. Therefore, the power centered around a pure monopoly is immense. No matter how unfair the pure monopoly price is, the buyers will have to stick to that price. For example, a special kind of medicine that is produced only by one and only producer will have pure monopoly. 4. Imperfect Monopoly Imperfect monopoly is a single firm that produces a commodity having no close substitutes. The degree of monopoly power is less than the perfect monopoly or the pure monopoly. In imperfect monopolies, it is easier for buyers to shift to a close substitute than in a pure monopoly. This market is commonly existent in the real world. 5. Natural Monopoly This monopoly market has something to do with natural benefits. It can occur due to reasons like specialization or availability of natural resource, etc. Therefore, natural monopoly is a case that arises due to natural causes. It also has common monopoly characteristics such as producing a unique good, price and quantity differentiation and entry barriers, etc. Natural monopoly offers the industry with a special benefit of producing the market at a lower cost. This particular instance supports them to win a larger part of the market. For example, Canada has a natural monopoly nickel production, while India has got monopoly in mica production at present. 6. Legal monopoly this particular situation arises when anybody receives or acquires monopoly power due to legal provisions in the country. In general, patents, trademarks and copyright safeguards product from an unauthorized use of a third party. Once copyright protection or trademark protection is available, the law forbids the potential competitors to imitate the form and design of products registered under the given brand names or trademarks. For example, company A has obtained a patent to produce a particular electric equipment. Therefore, it has power against other companies to defend its product from other companies. 7. Industrial Monopolies or Public Monopolies Industrial or public monopolies arise as a result of government action. Governments may nationalize some industries in public sectors in the general interest of the nation. In 1956, the Indian Industrial Policy Resolution, for example, emphatically lays down that certain sectors like atomic energy, arms and ammunition, railways and air transport will be the exclusive monopoly of the central government. So these are the total types of monopoly I have included in my video. Thanks for watching my video.